learning languages. I learned English with a British accent, English with an American accent. Ich habe Deutsch gelernt. Ich nicke für Jupa Ruski. Ich studiere Spanisch. Dopo imparare per Italiano. Ani lo me da bere per Ibrid. Mi ma lo metto nel francese. And there's something very special that happens when you start learning a language and you're immersed in it. You start losing your thoughts. You start not even knowing who you are anymore. I'm putting that. Um, <laughs> <sono mi>, <laughs> it's very scary, but after that period, you start thinking in the new language and dreaming in the new language and seeing life with the new the eyes of that culture, and that is fascinating. It's like you put a different skin on. Really impressed. <laughs> On a voyagé dans beaucoup de pays depuis que j'ai six mois, je suis en voyage, mais à la maison, on parlait toujours français. I learned English with a British accent because I grew up there, grew up in London. It's really interesting to observe. When I speak to people in a British accent, they're like, you're a totally different person. <laughs> It's really, really funny. Dann habe ich Deutsch gelernt, aber ich habe leider alles vergessen. Im letzten Jahr habe ich mich in Berlin verliebt während der Dreharbeiten für den Film Berlin I Love You, in dem ich gespielt habe. Es war meine erste Hauptrolle äh, in einem Spielfilm. Ja! Ich nie gewarju pa ruski, gewarju ochen plocha. Ich хочу сказать, что у меня есть мечты и огромные желания их реализовать. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, perdón, es que me estaba maquillando la cara. Eh, tengo orígenes españoles. Me gusta cómo me siento cuando bailo. Mm, pues nada. El problema es que dopo son andata en Italia. Son andata a vivir a Lecco, sul lago Como. Pero, ecco, todo mi español ha andado via. O sea, via. En el senso, es un pecado, ma ¿qué voy a hacer? E poi l'italiano, cioè, mi sono innamorata dell'Italia e mi sono innamorata in Italia. C'è un po' di... è molto forte, è molto... l'Italia è... c'è passione. Quando ci vado... Mm, uff. Is there a language that's most dear to my heart? No, they're all very dear to my heart. I think that is also why I love languages and why I do not feel like I belong to any culture in particular because we are all one people, the human being people. 